Alhamdulillah. Alhamdulillah. I am glad you are safe. Alhamdulillah. A first of many achievements to come, Basim. We should only hope. There's still much work to do. While our focus was on Al Ghul, Fulav quietly scouted the city for where we could erect more bureaus. I have found dwellings in three districts that are most unassuming. Ebid and Rebecca have arrived from Alamut and set off to Al Abbasia and Karh. I will make my way to Sharqia shortly. And I will join Rebecca in Karh, where corruption is as common as the arid air. See Abu Jafar about some things he's been working on. Then come find us. Okay. Have a look, Basim. I may have something that is of interest to you. Wait, that's a trap? Noise maker. This should serve me well. My thanks, Ahmad. It's Abu Jaf. <laughs> oh, you jest. Every now and again. Araka lahikan, Abu Jafar. Keep well. And you, Basim. Well met. I am sure you have not been idle. Take a look. Nothing else? Can you make this better? Be my guest. <clears throat> Hello there. Ah, I see our new Abbasiyah bureau is well guarded by an alert and active Rafiq. Bassem, <laughs> you startled me. I was just enjoying some poetry. Oh, who's? The court poet, Sayida Arib. Her words chirp like the birds of paradise. Ah, uh, yes. I have read her works. My friend Nihal and I used to sneak into the House of Wisdom when we were young. Hours we spent reading of gods and jinn. I always enjoyed this place. The House of Wisdom is not what it once was. Hmm. Is not our friend Ahmad ibn Musa there? He went to his workshop, as I recall. Yes. I sent a message for him to come and help set up this bureau, but he never replied. My spies could not contact him. A week has passed, and he cannot be found. So, one of the famous Banu Musa is missing in the House of Wisdom. Yes. Venture there and learn his fate. It shall be done. <laughs> New contracts have been posted on the board. Tabit, I would like to ask you something. Please, go ahead. What can you tell me about Ahmad ibn Musa? The son of a famous astronomer. Ahmed and his brothers excel at mathematics, invention, and scholarship. Together, they wrote the book of ingenious devices describing their wonderful clockwork automata. What made him join our cause? The Banu Musa were once close to Al Mutawakhil, but grew disgusted with the Abbasid Khilafah. What happened? They refused to discuss it, so I cannot say. There are many reasons to be disgusted with the Abbasids. Was there anything else? What is important in Abbasiyah? This district is the heart of learning in Baghdad. All the world's knowledge can be found here. Any key places to investigate? Follow the trail, wherever it yeah, leads. Yeah, before the Besides fucking the House of Templars Wisdom, burn it down. There are other vital landmarks. Be sure to mm. visit the four markets, the observatory, and the Dome of the Ass. 
I remember the whoa, whoa, whoa. did he get the ass? I met the great astronomer Al Khawarizmi there when I was young. Excellent. Finally, if you need to soothe so muscles, a steam bath at the splendid Hammam of Abyssia is a joy. After a night of clamoring across rooftops, that sounds good. Was there anything else? Any hint on what the Order might be doing in Abbasia? No, my friend. Not more than what I have told you. Although... No. It is probably nothing. What is it? Any little bit may help. Before he left, Ahmed ibn Musa said something about books going missing from the House of Wisdom. I will keep that in mind. Was there anything else? Tell me more about yourself, Tabit. Me? <laughs> Uh, not much to say. I love poetry. Is that enough? Come now. Do not be so modest. <sighs> As you wish. I come from Nubia, a dry land south of Egypt. My father sent me to Cairo to study Islam. There I learned a fiery sense of right from wrong. And the corruption in Cairo was very, very wrong. <sighs> we revolted. Our revolt failed, and I fled to Baghdad. The Hidden Ones took me in, and... Here I am. Someday, you should tell the whole tale. Was there anything else? No. Thank you, Tabid. That is all for now. of poetry by the famed Arib al Ma'muniya. He truly is a fan. People, calm yourselves. The fire was small and has been contained. Allah's wrath is upon us. Most of our books are safe. The danger has passed. Old man, how did this fire start? Old man? <laughs> Fazil Fahim is old. As old as the House of Wisdom, which he commands. Forgive me, Ustadi. I spoke in haste. Can I help? No. The fire has been quenched by the Watermaster's bucket brigades. Who started these fires? Ruffians, I suppose. Enemies of the Khalifa, to be exact. What sort of books were they burning? It is too soon to tell. Perhaps the caretaker of books would know. I am searching for Ahmad ibn Musa. Ah, yes. He has a workshop here, but I have not spoken to him lately. Peace be upon you, Elder. I shall go. I still need to find Ahmad ibn Musa. But I should also speak to the caretaker of books in the library. Partial list of books that were burned or gone missing. What is an ancient manuscript in unknown tongue? Fuck it. 
the caretaker of books. Something in his hand. Fabric. Torn from a woman's gown. But whose? He's dead. But he wrote Mansach in his own blood. I wonder. Strange fires and a dead caretaker. Horrifying. I should hurry. Greetings, Yaham. If I may, where is the scholar Ahmad ibn Musa? Ah, yes. The most adventurous of the Banu Musa. His workshop is right behind me. Thank you, Yaham. Basim, hey! Nine fingers, over here! Nihal! What do you have there, sneak thief? A book. I managed to save at least one from the fire. If they catch you stealing... They cut off a finger. No, wait. A whole hand. That is not funny. Then don't laugh. All right, you are in a mood, and I have things to do. Nothing that concerns you. Oh, secret hidden one stuff. What are you doing this time? Stabbing? Stealing? Stabbing and then stealing? That is your specialty, Nihal. Just because you lost a finger does not mean you've lost your touch. All these tools and books looks like Ahmad's room. But where is he? The letter says these books are for Ahmad. Ahmed always signs his work. This is definitely his doing. Measuring tools, like my father used to own. But these are Ahmed's. Another book of poetry by Harib. David would love this. seems to be working on something new. But what? Diagrams, machine tools, and other oddities. This is definitely Ahmad's workshop. But where can he be? Pardon me. May I help you? Sir, I'm speaking. I am looking for Ahmad ibn Musa. Do you know where I can find him? I may be able to help you. Follow me. Is this your first visit to the House of Wisdom? No. A friend and I used to sneak in as kids. We taught ourselves to read in your library. All young people should follow your worthy example. The caretakers who chased us out of the stacks every day did not think so. 
merely doing the job. And what did you study in the House of Wisdom? I loved poetry and heroic tales. My friend preferred pagan gods and dark magic. Interesting. <laughs> and did you follow your youthful passion and become a scholar? When the whole world awaits. No. You might say I am a man on a mission. Ah, well. What about your friend? No, no, she... still searches for something. Though what that is, I do not know. A shame. It's not far now. Hurry, hurry. Gun! 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 Help! I'm under attack! What? You lie! Help! Kill her loose! Time to vanish. <laughs> Please, don't hurt me. You led me into a trap. I should slay you where you stand. Spare kindly, Hamid. Then tell me, where is Ahmad ibn Musa? Please, sir. I don't know where he is. Truly, I do not. Then why lead me into an ambush? He... he made me do it. Who is he? Not Ahmed, surely. I don't know his name. For he always wears a mask. And what does this masked man want? He commands me to keep everyone away from the House of Wisdom's stick site. Or else... Or else what? He will hurt my head. Like with the others. Please, spare humble Hamid. Where is this dig site? It's in the wilderness, outside of the city. Hey, let me draw you a map. You're lucky. The map should lead me to the dig site. Don't worry. I am not here to kill you. What are you trying to crack? The book. I said I couldn't. This is not a language I know, but she gave me no choice. Who? A woman named Zahra. One of the scholars here. What is this book? What is it called? The only thing I know is that it is written in a script unlike any other. And I have seen hundreds. The way Zara mm. talks, it's more of an artifact or relic than a book. I uh, lied about my progress so they wouldn't kill me. I can't read a single word. I don't even know if it's a language. Where can I find Zahra? I don't know. She could be anywhere in the city. I... I just want to go home. All right, get to safety before the guards return. Help me. This book makes me uncomfortable. I will leave it here. This order letter mentions Arir. An innocent reference, or something more sinister. This peculiar machine. I saw something like it in. <laughs> Another book of poetry by Arib. She definitely is popular in certain circles.
Zahra is definitely tied to the Order, along with somebody named El Rabisu. Learned all I can. Better get to high ground and get ready. Zahra might return any minute. Servants, prepare a glass of dead juice on ice and serve it with a plate of honeyed bread and pomegranates. Then prepare the bath salts. I am utterly beat. Hmm. Paradise is where you find it. That old fool tinkering with his worthless ancient disc and helpless patience. Bah. Of course, say that. The real answers are in books. They are always in books. Am I not right? Always say that. When I get that book translated... <laughs> My God! Murder! Murder! Killed a couple. Help! Wild, but... hey. What are you doing? <sighs> Shit. Zahra thought that strange book would get their great work functioning. Good thing Hunayn could not translate a single word. Some scholars from the House of Wisdom got burned trying to save the books. We need that room for the patients. No! That's Dr. Hassan's private laboratory. It's locked. No one must go inside. So we just leave the burned victims outside? Will someone answer me? Please, use your indoor voice. You're upsetting the patients. Dr. Hassan keeps his laboratory locked up. I wonder why. Wow. There is nothing wrong with my message, only the mechanism itself. Needs more subjects, more work. I certainly do not need some useless inventor messing with the great work. Am I not the great and dreadful and I give up? Maybe I should not say that out loud. Focus, Hassan, focus.
crowd in here. Guards! I am here for you. Guards, hurry! The doctor is dead. Now to find Ahmed and solve this bloody mystery. Basim, what happened here? Where were you, Ahmed? I was around. I'm always around. Would you tell me what happened? Are you aware this man works for the Order? He called on me a few weeks ago after they found something in the desert. An ancient mechanism of some sort. They needed me to... And you asked no questions. I never ask questions when it comes to work. Do you? Tell me about this oh, mechanism. I thought you were hurt. It opens a path in the mind. A path to the ancient world. This mechanism somehow seems to open the doors of perception. Have you seen this for yourself? No, but I heard the stories of those who have. They are lost, Basim, because they think what they saw is reality. They think they belong to this ancient world. I knew nothing about the Order being involved. If I did, I would have come to you. I just... I got caught up. You know me. You know me, Basim. You will leave this place and return to the Bureau. I will not tell a soul if you do not. How shameful it is that knowledge always ends up in the wrong hands. Isn't it, Basim? 